welcome to the 2021 Goshen Friends School Clothesline Art Show. Yay! You can clap, friends. All right. I am here with the owls. And today, the owls are going to share their artwork, some of their artwork that they did this year in class with Teacher Kim and Teacher Lori and in their specials classroom. And this is the artwork. <gasps> What? Look at that. That is so impressive and beautiful. So really quickly, I'm also just going to show for our viewers so they can see there's artwork all over the room. All over the room. There's some more over there. That's some beautiful artwork too. Over there, the butterflies artwork. The bumblebees are over there. The bears are over there. So just so you know, parents and families and friends, we've got lots of artwork here. But today we're just gonna talk about the owls, okay? I see an amazing bird. What bird is this? An owl. An owl, just like our class. Did we make owls in the owl class? How cool is that? What is your favorite part about this owl? What do you think looks the coolest? The, 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 the. Those? Yeah. Are those feathers or scales? Feathers. Good, because he's not a fish, right? Is this owl a boy or a girl? It's a girl. It's a girl? This is a girl? Is that why you put pink on here? Is that her favorite color, maybe? Yeah. Which is your favorite color on here? Red. Red. Good. Very good. I like all these colorful feathers in the middle. Did you have fun drawing those? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah? Pretty fun. Do you have little eyes or big eyes? Yeah, the better to see the things that they like to eat, right? Yeah. Helps them hunt them down in the nighttime. That's why the black paper, right? Yeah. Owls sleep all day and they come out at night. Great. All right. In the middle of the winter, we made these, what are these things called that you put on your hand? Uh, a hand yeah, mittens, right? <laughs> and you know what I, lo I love about your mitten? What? I love... You didn't use too many colors, did you? What two colors did you use? Blue. blue and red. But I think blue and red look so good together. When you get older, you'll learn about warm colors and cool colors. Blue is cool and red is warm, but they look so neat. Why, why would we hang them mittens up to dry, do you think, in the winter? Because that really wet. They get really wet. So I just love your mitten hanging on the clothesline. Do you remember what we sprinkled on, on the paint to make the snowflakes? Salt. Salt. Did you like doing that? Do you like putting all that salt on there? It looks super snowy, doesn't it? Now tell me what you like about this. Um, I like a red and a You like the little clothespins too? Well, it's very nice and it's very wintry. I like it. This is yours. Do you remember making this? Yeah, huh? you do you? We made these when it was Martin Luther King Jr.'s birthday. Do you remember what this is called? A peace sign, right? It's a peace sign. And we use lots of different doodah colors. What color in here is your favorite? Hmm? Which color do you like the best? Oh, you hear the airplane outside? I hear it too. Which color on this peace sign do you like the best? Green and new. You like all of them? Yeah. They, they blend really nicely together. Thank you for talking about your peace sign with me. Come on up, my friend. In the middle of the winter, we made some very tall buildings. Do you remember what they were called? Skyscrapers. And what did you make in the sky? Snow. A lot of it, right? Is it a big, big snowstorm? And what's going on here? What are these little yellow Windows. squares? Windows, are there people in the buildings? Nobody's home at the moment? During the big snowstorm, did they all go home so they didn't have to stay in the big buildings? Did you like doing this? You like, put, tell me what you liked about doing this. Yeah, you like doing the snow. But you did a good job with the windows too. I like it, very wintry. Good job. I had to bring it down a little lower. Yours was hanging really high up. What'd you make here? An owl, right? All right, nighttime owl. What was your favorite part of this owl? 
Ah, the fluffy pink feather. Do you like that color? Pretty bright, huh? Do you think this owl is a girl owl or a boy owl? A girl. This is a girl owl? Okay, good. What do owls like to eat? Do you remember anything that owls like to eat? Squeak, 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 squeak. Nah. Oh, they love mice. They love to eat mice and other things that they can catch with their talons. This is what you put down here, their feet with their pointy claws. Very nice work on this beautiful girl owl. Okay, why don't you come on over here? When springtime came, we had some, some special bushes blooming and they were very pretty. You probably don't remember the name of them. Remember the name of them? It's a big, long name, hyacinths. Hyacinths. You, you made some really nice hyacinths, but you know what I really like? There's a metal called copper. And for some reason, you your vase that your hyacinths are in looks kind of like copper. What did you like about doing this one? Oh, you like the brown, the stems? You like putting the stems on? Got to have the stems to have the flowers, right? And did you like scrunching up the paper too? Yeah, it's kind of fun to scrunch. Well, it's very beautiful and it's very springy. And after a long snowy winter, it was nice to see some flowers, wasn't it? There we go. What did you like about doing this? Because I like those pink dots. Yeah, you liked all these colors? Yeah. Do you have a favorite color? Yeah, and then you got put a lot of pink on there too, didn't you? And you put a lot of flowers. Did you like doing the scrunching? Yeah. Yeah. I like this big scrunches, scrunching them a lot. And you made a lot of scrunches, didn't you? I put all of them right there. Yeah. Everywhere. They're, they're everywhere. And you filled it up. It's so pretty. You'll be able to take that home. Nice job. Mm -hmm. Thank you. All right. Wow, thank you so much for sharing your beautiful artwork with us today, Owls. It was really, really fun to hear you talk about your artwork. And thank you to Teacher Chris and to Teacher Kim and Teacher Lori. And can you give yourselves a round of applause? Thank you, friends.